Matt is now resident of Gakurdi village in Jibia local government area of Katsina state have been assured of safety of their lives and property. The commissioner of police in the state, Dauda Daban, said this when he took a tour of the village after 12 people were killed yesterday during bandits' attack on the community. TVC News correspondent Abdul TV Suf reports. On arrival at the village with the commissioner of police and his fully armed escort, we met the grieving community in a prayer session and some groups still discussing the unfortunate killing of 12 people. Funeral prayers according to Islamic rites then followed. The majority of the deceased were shot while attempting to run for their lives. They have been coming to this area frequently, which was why we started making efforts to mobilize some equipment to protect ourselves. We are not safe at all, and we believe things cannot go on like this. Life is so unbearable. We need prayers and help from the police and the government. The bandits have always taken advantage of the bad terrain to execute their mission without mercy. Along the road to the village, we also saw clusters of women and children working to relocate to safer places. <laughs> The police commissioner took a tour of the village, inspecting the burned down houses and reassuring people they will get the protection they deserve. We actually felt <laughs> bad about it. And that's why we came here, and the police team and uh, the military team came here to assess the situation and to know the way forward. Um, uh, we were told by the village that uh, this is not the first time that they have come here and uh, if you, you cannot even see a, a foul here now. All have been taken away by the hoodlums. The frequent attacks on remote villages is now a source of concern, hence the need to strategize towards dealing with this situation. Abdullah TV Yusuf, TVC News, Kasana.